Hi there, and welcome to another video for algorithms and data structures. In this video, we're going to introduce a new problem. It's searching for an item in a list. To illustrate this problem, I've taken some random books from my bookshelf and ordered them on my table, in no particular order. And what we're going to do is in this shelf, or in this list of books rather, we're going to look for one specific book. It's called Just Mercy. So what are we going to do? Well, we're going to start with a very naive approach. We're going to start at the top of the list. Now, unfortunately, we can't see the first book, Fallen the Quartius, but fortunately, it's not the book we need. So let's start with algorithms and data structures in Python. This is not the book we want, so we move on. Another algorithms and data structures book, Java and two semesters, computer organization, Delft's the foundations of computation, a bunch of Harry Potter books, not what we're looking for in this case, but Dutchy, To Kill a Mockingbird, some Grisham, well, it's about the law, but not what we're looking for. Joop van Heck, David Mitchell, The Book of Dust, something by Yahtzee, Mark Jimenez, Stieg Larsen, ah, there we go. Just Mercy by Brian Stevenson. We found it after just 26 books. Surely there is a more effective way to look at my bookshelf though. Give me a second and I'll try to figure something out. All right, so I've sorted my books based on their title. So you can see now at the top left, we have the first book, A Clan of Kings, and at the bottom right, we have World of Trouble. A to W in my case, couldn't find a book with a Z. Now that the list is sorted, and that the books are sorted on title, maybe we can do something more clever. How about we just start somewhere around the middle? This one looks about to be the middle. Uh, the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. The. Hmm. Well, we're still looking for this book called Just Mercy, and J definitely comes before T, so we should look somewhere to the left of this book. So somewhere to the left. Well, let's just go up a row. So we'll find there Goede Woede by Joop van Heck. Hmm, G, now G is before J, so somewhere to the right. So let's make some jump to the right. Let's take a look at this book. It's King and Maxwell by David Baldacci. Well, K is after J, so we overshot. So, well, we need to go back a little bit to the left. Uh, let's try this one. Mm, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone, no. Ages before J, so somewhere to the right. Java and two semesters. Ah, we're at the J, but Java comes before just. So a little bit more to the right. And there we go. We found it. Just Mercy by Brian Stevenson. Now, even though our process wasn't all that well defined yet, already I hope you can see that we can save out on a lot of work. So this idea of searching in a sorted list by just jumping a bit to the left or jumping a bit to the right. Let's see if we can formalize that. Let's see if we can write an algorithm for this. And we'll do that in the next video.